Hey, David here at Westwood Music. Um, a lot of people come in with tuning pick problems, and uh, I like to kind of like take this opportunity to talk about tuning pigs. So this is a modern, what we call a sealed gear tuning pig. You have the post here that comes up through the headstock of the guitar, the string attaches to it, right? And in the back, this is sealed. There's a gear in there. It's packed with grease, and it'll last really, really long time. And they're smooth. They hold their tuning excellently. Uh, between the button and the housing is this little nylon washer, and its purpose is simply to give you a smooth glide as you turn. And that's what it looks like right down there. It's pretty small. And here's the issue that happens. So I find a lot of people are under the false impression that if they put a screwdriver here and tighten this as hard as they can, that the guitar will stay in tune better. Uh, but that, that is not the case. It's not going to make any difference to it staying in tune. What it's going to do is break that little washer, and then your tuning peg is going to be really grindy and, and, and yucky. So you just kind of want to leave this where it's got some friction, but it's easy and smooth to turn. Leave it at that. So the other thing is how to put the string on so that it won't slip and go out of tune on you. And I'm going to show you a real easy method that works really well. So here's my E string. I put the hole in the post at an angle like that to the string. That's a good place to start. Wind it through. And I've got about this much uh, slack. That's a fair bit. And what I'm going to do, you're back to the post. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm always going to be holding with my hand the string to keep it under control. Right on the post, I'm going to bend it like that. So it's got a bend on each side. And we are going to do the first winding over this extra part. And then we're going to wind under it and have about three or four wraps around the tuning peg going down. So here we go. I'll do it slow. First we'll go over. And then with my finger, which I'm controlling the string, I'm going under. And we're just about there. Got a couple wraps underneath there. That should hold it just fine. Tune it. And you're done. That will that will hold. It won't slip because you've got a winding above and below the string as it goes through, and it just grips it, and it's a done deal. And when you want to remove the string, there's no locking, twisting, any knots, nothing. It just slides right out, so it's really cool. So um, I hope that was helpful, and bye-bye. Uh, Have a great Christmas and holiday season.